Hello everyone, this is Wolf again. Who here? Welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Sly 3 Bands of Feet. <laughs> I mean Sly 3 on our lawn fees. I way screwed it up. <laughs> First I was going to say and the fees with Kunis, and then I said Bands of Feet. <laughs> yeah. In yeah, that episode, um... We log into uh, Octavia's computer and... Something, something. Whatever. But now it's time to get a trophy. Yes, we got a trophy. So we got two slide jobs and a Bentley job. Yeah. And oh, really, the I can't say what we mean much as we go further with the game. So, actually, I think I'll switch as. No, no, no. First off, well, actually I grinded out some money to buy all these moves. Especially you have quite a lot often, so let's just buy all of them, except for the combat dodge. Oh, well, I couldn't buy all of them, but hey, what can you do? There's my trophy. The long clock, useless adrenaline burst. I won it. I should put the R2 button again. Let's see how. Yeah, we'll see you later, but hey, here's Mo again. Sly said you were looking for me. We need your help to destroy some tar drums. I'm done with all that. I found a new path. It's full of peacefulness. Come on, what happened to the Murray? The guy who'd get into a fist fight with ten thugs wearing nothing but a towel. The guy who used to punch first and not bother asking questions later. Where's that guy? Where's my old friend? I, I'm sorry, Bentley. I, I tried to save you, but I just wasn't strong enough. Get over it, Murray. I don't blame you and never have. The only thing I feel bad about is losing my pal. Look, I want to help you. You're like my second best friend. It's just that I promised I'd stay here and peacefully meditate till the black water ran pure. Well, what if you could help us peacefully? You wouldn't have to punch anyone. I'm in. Keep it peaceful and I'll smash up anything you'd like. As a student of the Australian Dreamtime, I'm sure you've learned of the ball form? Yeah, sure, like my first week. Excellent. Tuck into ball form and clog that vent pipe. The pressure buildup should shoot you skyward. Maintain your ball form and smash into the tar drums around town. Awesome. Yeah, that's totally peaceful. I'm sure my guru wouldn't mind. Press the L1 button to go into ball form. Okay, so we're now playing as Murray finally. <laughs> he basically controls the same as he did in slide 2. But, he has a new move that, well, we, we need to lose. And that he can co up into a ball. And if we go in here, it should launch us straight up into the air. And you can do this. Yep, we become a bouncing ball. Ah, uh, really, this is kind of awesome. I uh, need to get back in now. Kaboom! Honestly, this is really fun. I love doing this. Hey, okay, we got six tart drums to destroy, so. That's what we shall be doing. And, oh, come on! There we go. Those tar drums are an integral part of Octavio's <laughs> scheme. With them out of the picture, you're that much closer to seeing the black water run clear. I promise. <laughs> okay, yeah, so Murray will rejoin the team until Octavio starts pluing the damn waters. <laughs> Okay, that's what we should do. So yeah. Da, 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 da. I can't wish the ball you go faster when you're in the ball, but what can you do? 
Halfway there. Okay. Boing. Boing. We where? There was a tar drum next to the safe house. Jeez. Okay, now we're heading near the police headquarters. Smash dish. Dish. This. <laughs> oh, please, Bentley. Okay. And the last one is. Why are we there? Next to that statue there. Bouncy. Boing. And. Done. It's a pleasure to see you back in action. Yeah, well, I haven't forgotten who my friends are. I'm just playing with a different deck. Okay, whatever you say, Moe. And there's a badass looking pose for Noe. <laughs> Dear Lord, I called Moe badass. Uh, uh, no, do I have enough money for the... the was it a combat dodge? I forgot. Okay, the West Sus slide job, so let's do turf war! Bentley, looks like you found one of Octavio's Vincenetti goons. You on your way to the police station for the old bait and switch? Yeah, he's following me. Too close for comfort. He gotta move. Now to get those mercenary apes involved. Hey, uh, are you back up so home? We don't need no more stupid dogs in Venezia. I might not be a real cop, but I've got feelings, pal. Have you just heard them? You talking to me, fruitcake? Cause I don't need a date. Eat missile, punk. This was a good plan, Bentley. Now we can just sit back and watch the fireworks. Thank you. I pride myself on deviousness these days. With her eight guard under fire, there's a 93% chance that Carmelita will arrive and take out the entire Vincenetti gang. Devious. Inspector Fox, I'm glad to see you. This Vincenetti puke is giving me all I can handle. Stand your ground, soldier. We'll take them together. Okay. Don't worry, we'll be splatting in everywhere. <laughs> Not that kind of stuff, but... Yes! We're actually playing as Carmelita! Yeah! Now, this was all a special thing about Sly 3. It introduced more playable characters <laughs> instead of usual 3. So? Blah, blah, blah. So yes, we're finally for players currently, and well, she does kind of control a bit stiff. Well, at least when we're in stealth mode, which you can turn off. But yes, she controls. She is a bit. She is a bit stiff, but she controls fine, and has and her. What's it called? I forgot. Her blaster. So her sh sure does a really good job at getting rid of enemies for sure. Though so when I'm in control commonly, uh, she kicks ass. <laughs> Basically. So yeah, I love playing commonly. I think she's a great addition to the playable roster. Also, I mean, we did technically play as commonly. Uh, Back in the first game, but that was just another tourist session. We really. this time we actually properly get to play as Carmelie, and she's awesome. And also, if you press circle button, she can jump insanely high. Okay, not as high as the Mega Jump from Slide Two, but still pretty damn high. Okay. So yeah, she's an awesome character player. If I was Carmelie, I would have Slide Cooper Wested. Before the first game even started, I don't know. 
So yeah, so we gotta get with all these jetpack dudes here. Ah, uh, gotta get with all these jetpack dudes. And we, and of course, we don't know where do this to benefit Sly Cooper. But hey, I guess Conley wouldn't mind. They both know that they're in love with each other, but of course they, they pretend they don't because I don't know. Also, that's the most distracting sign I've ever seen in my life. I want to destroy it. Maybe I will destroy. <laughs> uh. Whatever. Obvious foreshadowings aside, let's. But these are the last two jetpacks dudes to take down. So yeah. Just spam attack bow multiple times until you, you be on this job. Should be the last guy to take down and there we go. For mercenaries, you fought with honor and distinction. I'm proud of you. I I'm proud of you. Uh, God, I'm, I'm sorry, but this the voice actor that currently has for this game is the worst voice actor for this game. It just sounds of tattooed French. Ugh. But there you go. Now let's move on to the next job. I'm not good for. Um, I mean, job for Sly, but actually we'll play as Connolly and not Sly, so... The icons... The symbols are pretty misleading, I mean... Why isn't that previous job had a Connolly a symbol, not a Sly, whatever. Octavio keeps the blueprints to his main tar pumping station in three parts. Each is cleverly hidden behind a painting inside one of his legit coffee houses. Not very subtle, posting a full-time guard in front of a coffee house. Since we destroyed his Ferris wheel, he's gone all out on the security. In fact, he's got all his guards checking up on each other. If we're going to get inside and at the blueprints, we can't raise any suspicion. I'm with you. I'll approach the guard while in disguise and pretend to take the next shift. When the coast is clear, you head inside and swipe the blueprints. With me standing out front, no one will know that something's up. Your disguise could be a side as power. <sighs> I'm gonna talk about Bentley, sorry, but here's a new gameplay. Well, no, here's a new gadget. Well, yeah, here's a new theme we can use. Disguises. There's only three in the whole game, but here we got the Fennus disguise, and it does exactly what it is. It makes Psycho look absolutely ridiculous. And. And. It basically fools the guards and makes you put passwords when they read disguise. Okay. okay. I guess you're the relief shift. Thanks for coming early. I got a big plans for tonight. Carnival. A good time, eh? I can't believe that worked. You've got the worst Italian accent I've ever heard. No offense. Head inside and grab the blueprints. No telling how long till another patrol comes by. First coffee house I've ever seen with wall to wall laser security. Sure, Sly. <laughs> So blah so blah 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 blah. She barely sh sure was white. Oh yeah. Don't mind me. I'm just breaking their vein of wound to give herself tons of coins. Cause I still got a one move I need to buy. I can break these tables, but be careful not to get burned up by the lasers. What kind of lasers are they? They burn you up. But yeah. Uh, there's another new thing that, well, you rarely do in the game. Used to crack these all the time. The trick here is finding the safe's combination hidden somewhere in the artwork. 
Might take some searching, but it's sure to be there. Just keep at it. Okay, well, Slife, we just explain this. We got a playbill, where's Waldo here? We got a search hold a pane of magnifying glass until we find the hidden code. And then we input in these classic Sly 1 vaults. And we get Venice Blueprint 1! <laughs> Uh. Okay, so that's the first what the one out. That's the first one out of three we got, in, and this is a bad idea. Why am I doing this? Why am I so greedy? I love how every time Burnley gets high, he screams, "Why?" <laughs> Perfect. You at the next coffee shop. Once you take the guards post, I'll move in. Second verse, same as the first. Okay, then we on to the second one. Yeah. The way you disguised, you can attack for obvious reasons. And well, then you move at a walking speed, so yeah. Basically you can do this to full guards, but What's the midnight password? Easy one, here you go. Soplano, soplano. Alto, alto. Alto, bless, alto, bless. <laughs> uh, that's short of a friend, Mr. Mario. So, wait, you can use disguises to ignore God. Walk by God's about to attack you, but you gotta input passwords all the time. And. Eh, I don't mind it. I mean, it can be a little bit of a time waster, but. Whether it's just to avoid all the annoying guards, like this one, one here. Oh no, it's the oh, next one we need to get. So, if you're familiar with punching in cheat codes, because this is exactly what it is. So, flat lots of fruit. I'm glad you're here. Mama's making spaghetti tonight, and I'm starving. I'm gonna eat like three, no, four plates of food. I guess that you really like her cooking. Mamma mia, I want to be buried in her sauce. It's a ham. Any problems with that guy? Said he wanted to be buried in his mom's pasta sauce. Yeah, that's uh, that's strange. Why, just like his mom's pasta sauce? What is wrong with you guys? Jeez. Well, Sly, you did grow up in an orphanage with us. Maybe the orphanage didn't give you good food. <laughs> hmm. Oh, poor Sly. Poor. I don't know. So, yeah, we've got Spotlight to deal with now. Uh, which. I don't know if they're easy to avoid or not, then. Yay! The table was sandwiched between two spotlights. And I just lost half my health. Great. Okay, what painting, what piece of art do we get to stare at this time? Give me the money! And give me all the bullets apparently. Okay, hey look it's Miss Ruby's... Um... Miss Ruby's... I forgot. Swamp, yes yeah, Swamp. I didn't see what the the code was, but I'm right, sure you can see it for yourself. There, I'm dead slay. All right, two out of three. Almost there, partner. Okay, so I don't know what the code was, but again, you can clearly see it. Yay! All the tables were spawned. This looks like a good place to grind. But we. But. Ba 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 ba. Eh. Ow! I just want money, you assholes. 
Just stand out hidden in all your furniture. Ah. You know, maybe there's a good Italian restaurant around here. Enough with the sauce! Keep your focus, we're on a job here! Bugs everywhere! Bath around every corner! You're right. We got one more coffee house to hit, then we're done. Yes, now you're talking sense! And then, we eat. Enough! Ah, <laughs> oh, sorry, I... Sorry if I destroyed your ears, but... <laughs> I've, that was really funny. <laughs> uh, I just did that while it's poisonous. Uh, anyways. <sighs> Last. Last. Best blueprint to get. Halt. What's the midnight password? As I expected. Uh, no. Circle X, circle, circle. All on your turns. Alto, alto. Okay. Out of place, alto, alto. I'm a musician and you must die. Before that, I'm going to take all your coins. And now you can die. Okay. Ah. Uh, still thinking about that bit. Get. 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 get, get okay. Well, it's next to that god awful sign there. Another water trap. Now we'll never use. Okay, there he is. The last guard. Hey, you! Vacuum room password. Sending password now. Uh, triangle, triangle, XX. On your terms. Soprano, soprano, bass, bass. Yep. Yeah, you know the code. But what's my nickname? <laughs> There's only one Tony B on the payroll, and I'm famous in the family. I'm a new, uh, just got called in from Rome. They know me in Rome. I'm practically the mayor of organized crime in Rome. You telling me you never heard my nickname, Dave? Uh, my cell phones are going off. I should take this call. It could be the boss. Yeah, okay. Ah, great. The other guards in the area and see if any of them sure. Well, we can't go, go in there. Nah, unless we know a nickname, that selfish, egotistical bastard. So, let's see. Probably this guy wants us dead, so we're gonna go talk to him, unfortunately. And I go to sneeze. <laughs> Told you. And I apologize. Ugh. Don't know who I really am, so my disguise isn't working. We actually just run away instead of. Game burnt. Or oh, I can kill and that works too. Good thing there was health there. Just gotta wait until my long calms down, which it did. Okay. Now I completely forgot who I am, so You there. Ferris wheel password. Quickly. Mandatory password. Triangle circle circle triangle. On your terms. Soprano alto alto soprano. Okay, you're legit. Hey, you know Tony B's nickname? Tony B? That cannoli, he's a, what's it called, a, a egomaniac. I don't know nothing about him, don't wanna know. Well, you're helpful. But hey, at least you agree with me, he's sure, he is definitely an egomaniac. Ugh. Okay. That cat wants us dead, but I'm not gonna let him. There's no. There's no owl there or pet. Oh, why are species there? Whatever. But so uh, let's actually talk to the cat on the roof there. Uh. Okay. I guess. Okay. Hey yo, what's Octavio's house password? Transmitting password. Uh, square triangle, square triangle. On your terms. Tenor soprano, tenor soprano. Okay. Yep. That's the password. Sometimes I forget them, you know. You and me are both, pal. Hey, uh, you know what the Tony B's a nickname is? Ha <laughs> Yeah, that fathead likes to call himself Tony the Killer B. What an idiot. 
I couldn't agree more. Nice job getting the nickname. You're really fitting in with these mobsters, Sly. Maybe you should switch teams. Get an apartment with the killer bee. Ugh, <laughs> no thank you. Ah, uh, so... Good thing I'm not the only one who thinks he's a asshole. All the others think he is as well. Okay, now we can tell his name is and so finally lay us in. Hey! I was always in wants us to ask the password again. Fine, XXX Triangle. Bass, 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 soprano? Sorry about that. So, big shot, what's my nickname? Oh, come on, everyone's a heard of Tony the Killer Bee. -a. You're a the terror of every a player grounder from here at the Sicily. Ha ha ha, real funny. Least I'm not on guard duty during Carnival. Who's got the last laugh now, tough guy? <laughs> Me, that's who. Don't take too long. If that guy comes back to chat, I'm out of here. You've got real skill with this art decryption, Bentley. It always takes me like 20 minutes to figure those things out. You're just flying through them. But you realize I ain't a great god. <laughs> I still love that quote. Hey, it's the contestant's place. Okay, not really, but come on. Okay, wh where's the code this time? Hmm. Also, I don't remember where they are, so. Is it down there? No. I mean, this is definitely the contestant's place. Oh, there it is. 113. Okay. 113. Fenice Boopin' free! I forgot to do the second one, so Fenice Boopin' 2! Ah, oh, great, an alarm. Of course. Ow! 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 I'm nearly dead. Can I get out of here without dying? Yes, I can. That was really close. Need to hide out back in the safe house. That alarm is attracting all kinds of guards. Agree. We've got the blueprints to the tar vacuum. Our work here is done. Okay. So now we're done. We need to just get back to the safe house because everyone wants our blood. Hang on, I got this. Got the adrenaline burst, so I can out one these. There you go. We're back. Pretty simple. Job complete. The safety of the safe house. Ah, the safety of the safe house. Ah, he should come at us like Cuba. Ah. <laughs> okay, so next time on Let's Play Slifey Bat. Uh, Slifey Honor on On Thieves. We shall be cleaning out the rest of jobs. So, I'll see you next time, guys. Later.